Hey, what's up, everybody? Super Nintendo Four here. Yeah, I know. I had to do like this first video of Deadpool. Well, it was really just me with a Deadpool mask on, and uh, it. The first thing I did was I tried to like do a haul video, but I had to delete that. And this is a block video, by the way, guys. This is, this is not a Silverman's Random Rants. Um, the whole Random Rants was covered by um, me and my, de and my Deadpool mask that I just recently bought from uh, the um, Amazon. And I, I gotta say, I actually did a really great job on that. Because um, after seeing the Deadpool movie, um, I had to like some time to do it and all that stuff and um if you're wondering what I'm going to do with the Star Wars figure uh figure haul thing I might just review it as myself because apparently I don't know so let's see what else um Oh yeah, oh, hold on. Let me uh, get this camera. Yeah. So apparently, uh, the end of my job is almost coming. I still have like two more months, which is kind of a good thing. And um, I also got to show you guys what I got. I got a Fox McCloud plush for 11 bucks at Toys R Us, and it's just the little cutest, coolest thing ever. Look at that. That is awesome. I might do a, I might um, do like some adventures with Fox McCloud being like this plush and all. Huh? Maybe I should. I don't know. So, for all you don't guys don't know, um, this is the Deadpool mask that I was, um, that I got. Some people... I mean, my little about this mask is how awesome it was created. I'm gonna use it, I'm gonna be, um, dressing like him for Comic-Con. That's, that's what the mask is for. But, I mean, Comic-Con I'm in school, not, not anything else. Um, and, uh, let's see what else. Um, let's see, oh yeah, um, I'll get you up to date on, um, the money from my check as soon as I can, right now it's just like, yeah, also I've been wondering when they're gonna do that Sly Cooper movie, it, it, it's been like years and years and people have been saying it's in the works. People saying that it's going to come in 2016. But they haven't said when, like, what year in 2016. Um, well, year, what am I saying? Uh, what, uh, what, they haven't, they haven't said what, um, month. Yeah, I got this one. What month it was. And, that really just, I was looking on uh, movieweb.com, which is where I get all, where, which is where I look up all the movies that were coming out, and it didn't say when the movie came out, maybe it'll have a, a trailer released on YouTube on Regal Cinema's website, so I'll have to check that out, but, uh, yeah, apparently, if you can see, I'm... I'm just, I just don't understand, I mean, like, when, when, um, I did the Deadpool rant, I, um, I say that a lot of people were not liking the new Ghostbusters, well, well, here's what I forgot to say, is, the only reason they don't like that is because, one, it's a reboot, and reboots don't usually do as good as anything was, like, what the Amazing Spider-Man Two, um, and though the Amazing Spider-Man One was better than the Amazing Spider-Man Two, 
And also because of the female cast. Yeah, apparently they do not like this movie because for some reason they like to make fun of how it's all female cast. Um, I, I personally do not have a grudge against this at all. The whole entire time that this is happening, that this, that this happened, where everybody was like, hey, you know what, let's have, they're, they're, they're even having Ghostbusters, the new Ghostbusters reboot boycotted, kind of like what they did with Jim and their holograms, but the difference between that and, uh, the difference between that and, and, uh, oh, hold on, I had a, the, the difference between that and Jim and Holograms is, one, Jim and Holograms was not really based off of the show in the 80s. It was morally based off of something that was more from the 80s, but nothing else. And I, I just don't know what to say about it, the new Ghostbusters movie, but at least the new Ghostbusters movie actually does look pretty decent. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm not really a hater of movies as much as you know, except for, except for movies that are basically all comic book adaptations. Well, actually not comic book adaptations, I'm sorry. I lied. Um, what I'm trying to say is movies that are based off of cartoons and stuff, like in Spectre Gadget, um, you know, Scooby-Doo of the whole nine yards. Um, but yeah. So, you may be wondering, what is going on with the weather? Well, as you may have noticed, all of it is like rain, all the rain that is happening to the weather is flooding in. It just happens to be that for some reason in spring, yeah, and I'm saying this because this happens now, the weather patterns start to like get all rainy and nasty and stuff, and then for some reason it starts to flood. Now, yeah, and and I heard that one person that one person in that 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 was in the on the bus got, like, stuck, so some rescue oh, yeah. guys had to, like, oh, yeah, my, my mom is agreeing with me on this, because I, uh, watched the Today Show, and it actually, uh, was like, okay, they all got stuck, so the fire department had to, um, the rescue team had to get them out. I don't know what the heck that is, but for some reason, why can't they get... Here's my thoughts on it. It's on lower ground, so of course it's going to be flooded. But here's the thing. A lot of stuff that's on lower ground happens to affect the higher ground at, at no particular reason. Is there like a reason why that happens? I'm sorry I'm ranting for this, but it's true. I mean, I'm sick and tired of it flooding right now in Texas. Why does that have to do that? You know, it's all sunny in Texas, right? All sunny and cold. It doesn't usually flood. But in spring, it floods. And that's what ticks me the heck off. Anyway, I'm Superman 94. Hope you enjoyed this, uh, the, this uh, video log or vlog. I'll, I'll tell you what it is. I'll um, have to notify what it is when I uh, do the title sequence. Anyway, I'm Superman 94. And see ya.